What the problem is, dude, I got a big problem. I got a booger problem. Focus on doing this, that portion, because I don't want to get more space, and it's... Yeah, I felt great. Uh, maybe wind direction. Yeah, for now, I guess I'm... No boogers were eaten in the making of this film. Follow me for more recipes. Hashtag boogerwolf. <laughs> Oh, hey, I didn't know you go to school here, too. You're that kid that stole my bicycle. All right, so throttle practice felt really good. Now I'm gonna move on to something else and eventually combine them. This cutting practice, I'm gonna work on not staring up at my wing, but looking at the road, I'm gonna focus on just looking forward. I keep telling myself to do it as I'm kiting, but this time I'm gonna make like a really conscious effort to do it. Hopefully the end goal is, is when I got the motor on and I'm launching, I can really have confidence on working on just taxing, being able to pay attention to make sure my taxi is good before I do a full commitment. I know, really exciting stuff. I've probably made more videos for someone who doesn't have their motor yet or paraglides. Ah. I ordered my motor a while ago, I just haven't gotten it yet. So hopefully I can dial down my practicing and be able to pick that up and then start the the next step in all this, which is getting up in the air. I've had four flights, but they're all in April, so it's been a while. Oh yeah. All right. This is so stupid. I'm gonna trip over my phone, step on it, break it, I know it. Go. Yeah, didn't run fast now. I will say this, this little rig I got on me is a little bit of a distraction. Probably not the best idea. Go. I'm gonna give this one more go. I think the camera's too distracting. Cut. Nope. Yep, gonna put the camera down. It's too distracting. I've got like no wind out here, so I've gotta really gun it and control it. I'm taking this thing off. I have lots to do this week. A couple friends build a computer, got a crap ton of practice, and I gotta get done for band practice. If you ever wanna hear me play piano, go to the dentist. It sounds about the same. Hi. Man, all right, so got two theories of why I was struggling. One, I might just be out of practice and I wasn't, I was letting go of my ace way too soon. I have to check the video. Or it's felt nil out here. Maybe I've been going with the wind this whole time. Let's try it again. I got some work to do. Yeah, it's been a bit since I've been out just because it's been so gusty and rainy. It's been more than a week since I've been out. And I can definitely tell. So I got two theories of why I was having troubles. I think I was releasing my A's too early. The other thing was I moved across the field and then all of a sudden I didn't have any problems. I think I was actually kiting with the wind. But either way, I didn't get to work on just looking forward that just went back down to square one again like it seems to do every couple of weeks and get out there and it's like wow is this your first time i remember my first beer but 
Yeah, keep trying. All right, let's go for round two. Uh, talking with a friend last night too, he's like, man, you gotta get out of that park you're at. It's in the middle of a city surrounded by trees and he thinks I'm just dealing with a lot of rotor. And I'm getting there, I, I haven't been working really hard to find other suitable places where I'm at because my motor's been delayed. I kind of wasn't aggressive on that portion because I didn't want to get my hopes up. I did find a great LZ, also known in the business as a Lanzo in town. Huge nonprofit sports complex with a ton of fields and just outside the airspace and it's perfect. And they came back and said, hey, sign a liability form and you're good to go. And said also list us under your insurance. And I was like, ah, crap. But I think they might be waiving that insurance requirement for me. And if not, I have a someone close to me that is an insurance expert and he thinks he can find me appropriate insurance for like 150 bucks a year, which isn't bad for like the most pristine landing zone in town. So I, I won't argue with that price. I can't do that first flight insurance because I don't have PPG2 yet. And I've heard that's expensive. So either way, I got some options. But yeah, for now, I guess I'm, oh crap. There's a bunch of kids at the park. I ain't gonna be kiting. Brah, can't you go back inside kids and play some video games? All right, well, I guess I'm going to ball fields. Yeah, that's probably gonna be taken up too. No! Yeah, baseball season started. All the parks were taken up. I finally drove back to the first one and everybody cleared out. I need to start doing this in the morning. Woo. All right, that was nice. This is a pretty decent sized field. And uh, went the full length, it felt natural. Uh, we had a little bit of a breeze, so walked part of the way. I think the weather yesterday was just hitting me. That must have been it. Yep. do this. I was just going the wrong direction yesterday. It's rigging. I got some total snag hazard. That makes me feel way better. It's always a downer when you go out and you're like, why do I suck so bad? Well, you try going with the wind. Definitely won't help your case. It's like a turn to punch bowl. It's like a screen door on a submarine. It's like a hubcap on a track. This thing just snags. I'm not going to do too many of these shots. I'll just call out Joe. Hey Joe, come out here and film your attention big brother. Can I look at you? I'm looking. I'm looking at you. Still looking. Looking down. I can actually see my wing and my phone. I think this is cheating. It's terrible content. But I'm not looking out. Feeling it? Compensating? There we go. Oh, oh, oh.
Yeah. Better. Oh my Better. Much better. Yeah, it kind of helps if you kite into the wind. Yesterday I thought it was, no, I couldn't feel anything. Yeah, that was good. I even accomplished one of my goals, one of the runs, just staring down most of the time, which of course I need to do this a heck of a lot more. Kind of takes some patience and persistence. All right, going back at it. I, uh, I don't know, I'm kind of down in the dumps from this last week and I hit a pretty major hurdle in this paramotoring deal. I don't know, I've just been a ball of anxiety for the past several days. And I don't wanna really talk about it right now. Been wanting to go out, practice a bit, and I wasn't gonna do it tonight, but then I was, I've been kind of so upset that I figured if I don't go out, get active and just stay moving i'm just gonna want to sit around and fester so I'll go out there and see if i can't be productive and get into a better mood yeah essentially long story short i'm gonna be switching schools now the good news is not everything's bad I'm still fully committed to this it's just i tried awfully hard before getting into this to make sure i was making the right decision and i guess i didn't but at the same time i've fortunate enough being kind of solo in my area at the moment having some really supportive friends, friends who understand what I'm going through. I mean, they, they talk to me, encourage me, and and it, it helps a lot. I, I would have a way different attitude if I was having to deal with this with just me and my thoughts, so I really appreciate them. And the school I'm going to has it's been super gracious. I mean, they're really close to me. And even when I came back from training and I didn't train with them, I mean, they talked to me all the time, like, hey, you fly, you need to get over here and meet the crowd. But the, the trainer over there has agreed to really step in, give me a hand. and So I'm very fortunate. I'm lucky to know those people, especially getting into this not knowing anyone. And it sucks to think about because I'm sure there's a lot of people that feel alone doing this if they're, especially if, if you're not too social or if you're shy or you have a more humble reserved personality i can be that way but obviously i'm i'm loud i share things i'm i'm active on the internet and you know, i just make people laugh and get engrossed in this but not everybody's like that and that's perfectly fine a lot of loud type a personalities are obnoxious and i could probably be that way too but either way i was very visible and i had people that cared about what i was doing and i'm very fortunate for that that i got that support base so my my advice to you if you're getting into this is find an accountability buddy no matter if he's close by or not just someone you can talk to that cares about you you can get online get on reddit if you see someone saying something that you like just message them it's not gonna hurt there's there's a lot of people they actually are more than happy to talk and and just tell them hey i I don't have a good support base, just be nice to have someone to talk to. And there's a lot of people that offer that up. Just find one person, that's pretty important. All right, let's go kite. One, two, you know what to do. Oh, man. All right, looking down. That's what happens when you are really not into the wind. Wow. Okay, this is a bad day. Look down, I don't have that much room. There's not a lot of wind, but whatever wind is coming, it's making me want to go to the width of the field, so I'm just gonna stop with the POV cam. Just work on flying the sucker. It's not a great day to work on not looking. I don't have enough runway. Yeah, it helps if you, uh, if you launch into the wind. That's 
Rodin, I'm coming after you. Get out of my way, beef. <laughs> All right, that was fun. Feel a little bit better. Probably feel better once I get home and start drinking. Again, I really need to make it a point to bring out a pole with wind streamers. And streamers specifically, that will show you wind direction when you don't think there isn't any. Because first couple launches, I launched into perpendicular winds. We all saw how that worked out. And then even once it started going all right for me, that wing would I'd be kiting and whew, I'm just glad I got out at least got some air and work on working on trying to center myself because I'm I don't know what to think and feel right now I'm, I'm extremely frustrated the whole reason why I got into this is because out I got out of a bad situation and I'm right back into it but I'm fortunate very very lucky I think uh, people in my position they would have quit and I am very fortunate that one, I have a very strong desire to do this, and I've got a, I've got a really good support base, and I've got a lot of alcohol. Yeah! <laughs> What's going on? So, found a new special field. It's big, it's open, and there's more to it too. I like it. Go check it out. All right. Let me get some cutting practice in. I got a little bit of a breeze. I'm in a special new field. Yes. I'll talk about that later. But it is big and open. So, I'm gonna see what I can do. I'll try a reverse first. If it's not strong enough, then I'll get some forwards in. So Kyle Ogley's tip of striking a pose Madonna style and actually pivoting and walking towards your wing rather than sidestepping has helped me a bunch. Check it out. So, stay step forward, aim, get the Beep. sweat out of my eyes. Beep. Freaking hot.
and Breaks up. All right, that was fun. Winds were kind of dying down and shifting a wee bit, so I didn't get much time for reversing, but I had one good run. Ran off, had a good time. Didn't really have much for issues. Just nice getting a nice big open area. Yeah, my mood is just picking up here a bit. I've got several stories going on at the same time. This one, I just wanted to finish up my last kiting video. I think this will be my last like intro kiting video. I'm just like my journey at that stage of it. Yeah, I'm super stoked. I got one more issue on the back end that I need to get resolved. Hopefully it does. If it doesn't, it's, I don't know if I'm gonna face a delay in this th whole thing or not. I'm kinda so determined that even if my issue doesn't work out that I just press forward and I don't know. Yo guys, I think this wraps this one up. Gotta go home and eat a bunch of Beep. pills, chug some Beep. I'll try to Beep. one off before I pass out. Toodles noodles, stay regular. Don't get hit by a bus.